My name is Brandon Sweeney, and I'm going to show you how to make some bioplastic in your home. First, get a pot, a silicone spatula, a stove or a hot plate, a teaspoon and a tablespoon, some water, starch, glycerin, and vinegar. I've found that tapioca starch works the best, but almost any kind of starch will work. Before you start, get a silicone heat pad like this, or some aluminum foil so you have something to spread the starch on for it to dry. First, measure out one tablespoon of cornstarch. Four tablespoons of water, which I already pre-measured. A teaspoon of glycerin. and a teaspoon of vinegar. Mix everything while it's still cold, and once everything is thoroughly mixed, then you can turn the heat on low. It'll start out as a very white, milky looking mixture, but it'll soon start to get a little thick. You can see it's going to start to clump up, and it'll look like toothpaste in a second. Just keep on stirring. You have to stir for a little while longer. Turn it into a gel. Slightly opaque now, but you want it completely clear. When it looks and acts like this, and it starts bubbling up, and about this consistency, it's done. So just keep on stirring for another couple seconds. Turn off the heat. You notice that it's pretty much clear except for some bubbles. Spread it out as thin or thick as you like. Here's some of the plastic items I've made using starch. They range from thin, flexible pieces of plastic like this, slightly transparent, to colored pieces like this that are also flexible. This is an interesting piece that I made. Uh, it's impregnated with gauze. So it's thin and light, but also extremely strong and flexible. Big companies are just starting to catch on. They are already starting to make some things out of bioplastic. Gift cards, produce baskets, grocery bags, golf tees, tableware, and cutlery are just some of the newly emerging products. Most of them are made from a starch-based bioplastic, like what I've just shown you how to make. So what can you come up with to make for yourself? Biodegradable lunch bags, card holders, keychains. See what new things you can come up with, and you'll be doing your part to make the planet a little greener.